Council Member Eric Delon, and we have just received this proclamation for my father, Ralph Mercado. So, Mr. Delon, your position, who you are, what you do, why this is so important to you? Well, it's important because uh, as a city council member who represents 150,000 people, uh, about 60, 60 uh, percent or above all, all Hispanic, I think it, for, for Hispanic Heritage Month, your dad was a great icon for the community and a you know a symbol of, of uh, musical greatness. So I think it's very important that his his life's work uh, gets honored. Then also uh, as a father of two two young children who also happen to be Puerto Rican and Dominican, it's part of uh, continuing uh, the culture and extending the, the culture onto our children as well. So that would be my mission: is so that uh, when we uh, get older, that our children can carry on the legacy and the culture. Be the main thing focused on. That's wonderful. Thank you so much. So, one quick thing, in in making a proclamation happen, what what is that process about? It starts with you. It starts with me. Mm -hmm. It starts with the family. Okay. They get us a bio about the life's work and and, and and they get it to us. But it has to be. I mean, some people give them out loosely, and I've been here for ten years. I've done three. Mm. So. You know, I, I don't know you, I don't know, but you know, something like this, how could you not do it? Thank and you. How, how could you not do it? I've done three here. You know, I've given out others in my district, but in the council chambers, they don't, doesn't happen. Okay, so this is pretty important. So we've received this proclamation. Where do, so where are we here today? City, uh, well, this is the Immigrant Savings Bank is pitching in for City Hall, which is under renovation. Okay, uh, but the, significant, the, the significance of receiving the proclamation here 